Hi, Ed Gollett, Speedcast, here with my partner in crime, Al West, my unicorn builder. Al, how are you? I'm well, Ed. How about, how are you? Good. I like calling you my unicorn builder. It makes me feel bigger than I am. I like that. Today, we're talking about building a unicorn. But as you know, and as we know, and the people listening know, we're not professing to build a unicorn the way they did it. We're professing to use the technology, the intellectual property, and the process to build a better business. So Al, tell me about these 120 unicorns in Europe and tell me a little bit about how people were building these things. So we talked about this before and there's a lot of unicorns running around right now. It used to be a rarity, but now there's unicorns everywhere. And, and one of the main reasons for that is there's a lot more money that's been pumped into existence. So that creates a lot more value. But essentially when it comes to building a unicorn and why are there so many? There, there's a lot of factors to it. That was the number one. Number two, the valuations have really gone crazy. And those valuations are now coming back down to earth with the economy going through many different changes. We're officially in a recession, although we're not supposed to call it a recession. I love that, right? Uh, we're Everybody in one right now. Name. I know you saw the same news I did. Yeah, We're in that recession. And so now the Fed has pumped the brakes. It's not free money anymore. I mean, the cost of money is a real thing. And the valuations are falling as a result of that. So they're, these unicorns that were flying high now are coming back down to earth and are finding out that they may not be a unicorn anymore. They may be under that magical threshold of a billion dollars in valuation. But it is true that if you could get Mario Andretti in his heyday to teach you how to drive your car, you'd be a 10 time better driver at one tenth the time. So what we're really talking about is not just the valuation now, but taking the technology out of the brain of a unicorn builder, which is really unique, and making that technology and intellectual property go into a startup. That's really about the build phase of a startup. Isn't that correct? It is. And there, but it's not just build, it's actually there's several modes that a business goes through. You've got the build phase. You've got the acceleration phase where you're all about velocity and just a land grab, getting deals, getting landing customers. And then you get into that scale mode when you're really putting the wind in your sails. So there, there's multiple modes that you go through. And there's really not a handbook that says, here's how you do it to do it right. So my experience having built a unicorn is, is having access to those playbooks Uh, Once you have done it, you have the memory muscles and you can go do it again. And that's what we're helping companies to do is to put the right fundamental building blocks in place so that they can not only go from the first phase of the land grab through the acceleration, the velocity and ultimately scaling. I've been through all those phases and I can help companies wherever they're at get to the next level. Yeah. And I love that because when I said five ways, you're right. It's really five stages of five steps. This is great. We have some other conversations we're going to have getting more detailed, but I wanted to get past this because I don't know anybody doing this right now on LinkedIn or anywhere where you're actually talking to somebody who built, I mean, you literally built the ninth unicorn. So the learning is almost like going to a college class and in 20 minutes, you learn what it takes six months. Ed, the reason there's not anyone out there doing this on LinkedIn is once a company's valuation hits that billion dollar mark and they ultimately have a liquidity event, it makes you know the chief revenue officer fairly wealthy and they, they tend to hang it up and go sail the South Pacific. And I'm in a position where, hey, I've got experience. I'd like to give some back. So this has been great. This is Ways of Building Unicorn. Get to know us, join us. This is Ed Gall at a Speedcast here with my business associate, Al West. Thanks, Ed. You bet.